Hey, so I decided to just do a little check-in with you to see how you're doing, what is going on for you. Please uh, put in the comments if everything new is happening, if you want me, because tomorrow I'm doing a Facebook Live uh, on a specific topic. And Anita, um, who is helping me with the group, will um, share with you my suggestions, what we can talk about. And with the pool that we create, just know that you can always um, add uh, your things as well. So, yeah, first I just wanted to say that and I wanted to say thank you for all my new members in the group. And just to welcome you uh, and yeah, to welcome you and just encourage you to share your opinions, share your experiences, because the more communication we have, the more I can really also give back to you what you are actually um, needing. So these days I've been receiving so many uh, messages and actually with the first with already the first um, activation that I did on the 2nd of February and now also um, the second one that I did in English on 22nd of uh, February w where we were working on uh, with the portal um, I was like really getting these strong messages and I just decided to share a little bit um, here. So, um, yeah, what I've been feeling collectively, what has been going on uh, is a, a lot of confusion uh, also um, with everything happening on a collective level in the world. For how long is this going to take? Uh, feeling also trapped, feeling like there is no, no way out, especially if you are someone that uh, loves to travel, for example, or that would love to see their family, friends, etc., etc. But what I wanted actually to um, focus on is um, the, the fact uh, and the things that I've been observing and seeing in the just in the word for example the great reset if you don't if you haven't uh, heard anything about it i really suggest you to to google it and to read more about it and just um these politicians and uh, economists and like pe people that are wealthy and also the royal families coming together and talking about the Great Reset and sustainability and having a more beautiful connection to Earth and respect and all of that stuff. So, um, but honestly, I invite you to just check in with it and to feel everyone because we all can feel things. What do you feel with this? And <laughs> The thing that I wanted to um, mention here that I was just talking with my friend in the morning when we were sharing our breakfast is that uh, in Bosnia you have this um, uh, or like uh, however uh, you have this saying uh, which actually means the same shit just a different mask or just a different um, just a different um, package but um yeah honestly what i feel with all the energies is a huge abuse with the um, abuse of these beautiful principles and beautiful about the sustainability and things like that and i i don't know where things are gonna go and nobody knows um but i just encourage everyone in the in the group to even start thinking about it and uh, start feeling into it because I'm not also somebody that is uh, against everything and that it's um, that it's again against uh, the politics and everything um, but yeah let us think with our own heads and 
think about how we can co-create uh, this uh, reality because with everything that is happening it, it is uh, a reset in so many different ways uh, especially for our personal level like looking into what is really important for us what what really matters to share here is um, yeah this is the year that there is going to be a lot of um, new groups and communities creating and just what I've been noticing and I really felt the energy of Atlantis and the memories coming up from Atlantis and from Lemurian times just like my guides showing me things and just why those civilizations why there and the ego behind it so yeah i just wanted to share this and um yeah like um what do we really want um do we want the same package but just these beautiful words and to be manipulated are we still wanting somebody to guide us somebody to take decision decisions instead of us um, like this old way of leadership or do we want um, really like take decisions by ourselves um, which I'm not saying that um, that there is um, that you can do a lot you can do by your on your own by yourself by looking into those beliefs by working on those things and really liberating your mind liberating yourself and not be affected by it so much uh, but on the other side of course connection matters but recognizing if things are resonating with you or not because unfortunately also why am i mentioning um, the atlantis and the lemuria you have these beautiful people and really working uh, and really sharing so many beautiful things and supporting everyone in this transition which of course is also my um, my purpose here um, which is also about empowering you uh, and really um, step for you to step in your own power um, to yeah just find your yourself your own truth um, what do you want um, in your life but yeah what i wanted to um, share here as well just be aware of the manipulation around you and um, of this feeling like um, that somebody is just giving you you know um, giving you no choice <laughs> in things so um, remember that you have a free will and that you always have a choice and yeah unfortunately i also have seen some things going on in um in uh, spiritual communities uh, and yeah um, let us let go the this old uh, way of leadership and the patriarchate and um, really start thinking with our own heads really um, starting taking our own decisions and not doing things out of obligation and feeling like we don't have any choice um, in everything and yes uh, by seeing all that uh, for me personally and it's not just me personally but it's also feeling a lot of people um, on a collective level as well and many of uh, them are aren't even aware what is going on it's for me also interesting here I have this beautiful cat which is also like um, transforming so many uh, things but anyway, what I wanted to say is for me, there is a lot of uh, sadness that I'm feeling, disappointment. Um, and like I said, it's not just my own, but um, also on a collective level. And of course, anger and rage with this um, going on and just wanting, you know, uh, people uh, around you to awaken, to see. But having this, um, at the same time, having this awareness that everything has a divine plan and divine time uh, and everything is going on for a reason. And many times before the huge uh, break, the breakthrough, 
uh, things are going to worse and um, for us to go deeper into and deep into ourselves and looking into stuff and then asking ourselves are we really gonna do this again you know like we have done that so many times in so many past lifetimes and what I believe in and this is what I also shared in our as um, like and how I'm guided what I'm what I'm hearing from my guides is that it is so necessary for us to see and to remember everything also that happened um, and learn from it, learn from our, uh, our experiences, learn from our past, from this lifetime, from other lifetimes. And of course, um, really going into specific topics, uh, because like, for example, you have so many people just thinking about going back to nature or, you know, like going through to old ways um but what i would say here and what I, what i am just sharing from my guides forward is like yes le- looking into that but this is a different time that we are in right now and from all of those experiences from all of these different um modalities learn things okay and create something different okay that it's going to be aligned with this time and that's why i was last year repeating over and over again that it's about new new forms new shapes new ways so it's really about remembering downloading healing healing yourself and down downloading um knowledge wisdom uh downloading all these beautiful light codes um that are offered to us right now and really communicating these to these beautiful beings that are surrounding you the same way that they are surrounding me like creating this beautiful ritual for yourself that you have this connection every day and um, as well you know what I what I'm receiving is to bring those technologies because it is about technology as well technology about frequency the technology about different rays of light uh, but I'm really talking about technology on a different level um, on a galactic level from different um, planets from different um, galactic beings of light so really connect for that's why I was also saying that this is the year for all the star seeds for all the these people that came here to help with this transition to really remember and step forward and to really just share what they are receiving share what they are learning etc etc and this is what i'm also encouraging you to do here in this video what are you realizing right now what is happening for you right now are you feeling those things happening as well are you feeling that these are this honesty this um, you know like this this trust that that and the truth is not being said to you okay and i think that the interesting topic would be also to talk about in this group about manipulation for example and what are the the feelings that you feel with manipulation how can you recognize it so just let me know what do you think or spiral but seeing the truth seeing yourself seeing everything around you as it is okay and no judgment being a witness and deciding also what you want to do with it um so yeah uh, i just wanted to be clear for all the new members in this group that my group is not just about love and light and of course this is the crucial thing and it's not about any fight between um l- love um and light and um the shadow and i'm not gonna share messages like um the light is winning or anything like that um because for me this is still separation okay and of course we are all wounded and i really want you to feel um free and also um to feel safe to talk about uh your wounds and yeah not just love and light and of course we are integrating that we are stepping into that we are connecting more and more with our essence with our soul integrating our soul in, into these bodies 
um, these beautiful bodies that we are having, but at the same time, time having this awareness that the, there is a path that we are that we are uh, walking, and sometimes, and this was our last Facebook Live that we had, it's only about decision: are we participating in something or not, and putting a boundary there. So um, yeah, this is what I am encouraging you here. And yeah, be aware, be grounded, feel your body, enjoy this beautiful life. Thank you, thank you, thank you for um, joining me. And yeah, I'm excited for everything that we will co-create together. And yeah, see you tomorrow in Facebook Live. That was This was just like a simple and really, um, yeah, I felt, uh, felt a huge call.